falling in love again. I didn't want to. What's a guy to do? I just can't help it. I found another engine on, uh, on Craigslist. This is a uh, uh, seven horsepower uh, BMW marine engine and uh, it doesn't uh, it doesn't turn over uh, it was advertised as the uh, piston being frozen in there and, and I'm pretty sure it is turn it a little bit you can see it's it's got a uh, a crank start and it also came with the original starter, which wasn't attached. I don't know if it works or not. There's the uh, exhaust uh, coupling, I guess you call it. This is where you mix the, uh, the water with the exhaust in the marine engine. And maybe it goes that way. Nope, it goes this way. It's kind of tight there. I guess you got to wrap things around. And uh, all in all, there's, uh, there's a couple of pieces missing here and there, but it looks, uh, looks pretty complete and it looks pretty simple too to, uh, to get into and repair. Now maybe you've seen my other video. I have a, uh, this is a, uh, a clone of an engine built by the Hatz, H-A-T-Z, Hatz Corporation, Hatz in uh, Germany. And uh, Renault also made one, uh, BMW made one. The HOTS engine was designed for uh, industrial use and it was adapted by uh, BMW and Renault for, uh, for marine use. So uh, I have the uh, 7 horsepower Renault and I've actually had it running, maybe you've seen my video. So if I get this one running then I'll have uh, uh, two nations out of the European Union. I get an uh, Italian engine and a, uh, a Spanish engine and a couple others I can have my own European Union all in one boat. <laughs> oh well, uh, I'm just going to winterize this by uh, sealing it off, make sure it's uh, not going to get any more damage and save this baby for spring to do some work on. Got to put a couple of bolts back in because it was leaking tranny fluid all over my uh, truck on the way home. And just make sure it's, uh, it doesn't get any water, uh, water in it through some of these open uh, orifices. <laughs> oh boy. I've never tried this before. Let's see what the hell happens. That's it sitting on the ground, folks. Well, I didn't think it would work. It was real easy. Okay, folks, sorry about the, uh, the fuzzy uh, video. <laughs> the, uh, the wide angle lens I was using was actually had a smudge on the inside, uh, which I just uh, cleaned with an alcohol rub. So sorry about the the blur.